Here stands the building formerly known as Caledonian Hall. Erected in 1902 by local contractor George Wright, it initially functioned as a meeting place for persons of Scottish birth and descent, intended to propagate a love for the literature, music, and ancient games of Scotland. Though it housed several businesses in its early history, the building's cultural significance comes from the many secret and fraternal organizations that it housed. In addition to the Caledonian Society and the Soldiers and Sailors Club, this building also witnessed the mysterious rites and rituals of the ever-fraternal, ever-benevolent Royal Arcanum. The Royal Arcanum was founded in 1877 in Boston, Massachusetts by Dr. Darius Wilson and John A. Cummings upon the principle of combining cooperation and fraternity with the business of furnishing protection at the lowest cost. The basis of their fraternal brotherhood was to ensure that members would be financially and morally supported in times of dire need. Though the Royal Arcanum still exists today on a national level, Caledonian Hall fell out of use in the 1920s, and the Colorado Springs chapter of the Royal Arcanum faded into obscurity. Fortunately for you, we have found an archived recording of the Royal Arcanum's initiation ceremony, which offers a glimpse into the mysterious practices and rituals of this secret society. Within the recesses of the altar is concealed the royal secret. Before you can become with us a brother in charity, you must discover this secret and learn its mystic meaning. Search and find it. Now, what have you discovered? This tablet. And what characters are inscribed thereon? Uh, M hyphen. M hyphen, the mystic number. Now, do you find the key by which this mystic number may be read and explained? I, I find nothing more. Then our secret station has been despoiled of the key to the mystery. It is the protective badge of this order, and without it, the mystic number cannot be explained to this candidate. Brothers, who will find the key and make known to this seeker after truth the protection he unconsciously enjoys? Regent, I can find the key to our mystic number. Chaplain, you exemplify the charity that helps in times of need. Find then the key and enlighten this brother as to its uses. Brother, this is the key to the mystic number. It is the protective badge of the order. As soon as you began to bear the burdens which the order imposes, you were unconsciously placed under its protection and became entitled to share in all its benefits, privileges, and promises. The burdens are light and the benefits come to us in the hour of greatest need, even though we ourselves are unconscious of them. Brothers, are you all satisfied that our new brother will faithfully fulfill all his obligations? No! 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 no, 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 no we are not we satisfied! Put him, him to the chest! Put him to the chest! Engage in tests upon him! My brother, not yet can I invest you with all the rights of membership. A further test is required. Bear patiently, and all will be well. But in the meantime, brothers, let us sing.